All right, guys, what's going on? Welcome in. So there was a report that surfaced about like an hour, hour and a half ago here, uh, suggesting that Aaron Rodgers was actually in Egypt during the whole mandatory mini <laughs> him skipping mandatory minicamp. Um, and Rich Semini has been alluding to this for weeks now. So it doesn't come as a major, major shock. Uh, my personal take, it doesn't really matter. You know, at this point in time, you know, minicamp is you know, long gone. Uh, it's in the rear view. I'm focused on training camp, right? Um, and, uh, you know, of course, Roger skipping mandatory minicamp didn't sit well with everybody. And, you know, it's understandable. Nobody's, nobody's wrong in, in feeling, you know, upset or angry or, you know, what have you about the starting quarterback missing mandatory minicamp. Um, you know, again, you know, a fan can can feel however he wants to feel. If we think back to the Robert Sala press conference, he did say that the trip uh, or the absence rather uh, was because of something that really meant a lot to Rodgers and that the Jets were going to proceed to fine Aaron, which they should have, right? Because if he skips mandatory minicamp and the Jets proceed to not fine him, what does that send to not only just the Jets locker room, but to the rest to, to the rest of the NFL? That would have been an that would have made the situation ten times worse, right? You want to talk about a media uh, crap store, right? For lack of a better term, it's it, it would have been horrible, right? Such a bad look, but that's obviously not the case. The Jets find him along with, you know, of course, Hassan Reddick here, but yeah. So you know, apparently, uh, Rogers was in Egypt. You know, to be honest with you, I'm pretty jealous. I want to go to Egypt, Valley of the Kings, check out the pyramids and stuff. I think that'd be so much fun. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, Rogers is, I think he's back in the States at this point. Um, and we're looking ahead to training camp. So anyway, let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, go Jets.